Hi everybody. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to combine both fractions and decimals of an amount within a real life problem. So we told that Ali makes cookies. He has 5.4 kilograms of dough and he uses all of it to make the cookies. Each cookie uses 180 grams. He sells three fifths of the cookies at $5 each and then reduces the price by 15% to sell the rest of them. We've been asked to work out the total amount of money Ali makes. So the first thing we need to do is to work out how many cookies that he makes in total. And he uses 5.4 kilograms of dough. So the total number of cookies will be the 5.4 kilograms divided by the 180 grams. And we can convert this into grams by multiplying it by a thousand. So this becomes 5,400 grams divided by 180 grams, which gives us 30 cookies. Okay, so we're told that he sells all of these, and he sells three fifths of them at $5 each. So we need to work out three fifths of 30. And we can do this on our calculators. We can enter the fraction three over five, then we'll multiply this by 30, and we get 18. So he sells these 18 cookies at $5 each. Then we'll multiply the 18 cookies by $5 and we get a total of $90. And then we're told that he reduces his price by 15% and sells the rest of the cookies. So if he made 30 and he sold 18 of them at $5, We'll subtract the 18 cookies from the 30 original and this will give us 12 cookies that are left over. But now we need to find the price at which these were sold. If the original price is 100% and this is $5, then when we take away the 15%, which is our reduction, this will be 85% of the original $5. And again, we can work this out on our calculators. We know percentage means out of 100. So we'll have 85 divided by 100 or 0.85 multiplied by 5. We'll convert that to a decimal. And this will be 425. So when we sell 12 cookies at $4.25, we can work this out on a calculator. That's 12 multiplied by 4.25 and we get $51. So it makes the £90 plus the £51. So the total amount of money will be the 90 plus the 51 and this will give us $141. Okay? Let's try another question. In our second question, we're told that Sophie makes soap bars and that she has 12.5 kilograms of soap material and that each soap bar uses 250 grams. She sells four fifths of the soap bars for $8 each and then reduces his price by 10% and sells the rest. We've been asked to work out the total amount of money that Sophie makes. So perhaps you want to try this question yourself. You can pause the video and when you come back, We'll go through the work solution. Okay, so welcome back if you had a go. So we know she's got 12.5 kilograms and that each assault bar uses 250 grams. So the first thing we need to do is to convert this to grams. So we know one kilogram is a thousand grams. So we'll times this by a thousand and we get 12,500. So now we need to work out the total number of salt bars. So this will be 12,500 divided by 250. And this will give us 50 bars. And we're told that she sells four fifths of them at $8 each. So we need to work out how many bars this is. So the number sold at $8 will be four fifths of 50. We know one fifth is 10. We'll multiply that by four and we'll get 40 bars. So the total income at $8 each will be the 40 bars multiplied by the $8 and this gives us 320. 
and then we're told that she reduces the price by 10% and sells the rest of the salt bars. So now we need to work out the reduced price. If the original price is 100% and we're taking 10% off that, then this will be 90%. So we want the 90% or 0.9 multiplied by the $8. And this will give us a price of $7.20. So the income at seven dollars twenty each will be the seven twenty multiplied by the number of bars left which is ten and this will give us seventy two dollars so the total income will be the three hundred and twenty plus the seventy two which gives us a total of three hundred and ninety two dollars okay well thank you very much for watching I hope you found that useful if you did find that helpful, please like and subscribe, and you can download the full lesson from my website, mrmathematics.com.